Hello, 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 hello. We are back. I am back. D7 here with Grok and Trade. It's hump day, Wednesday, March 21st. Second day in spring here in the good old US of A. Thank you, Meerkat, for stepping in, doing videos for me. You are killing it. You're doing a good job. Here we are looking at the markets as a whole. Everybody down, 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 especially the NASDAQ down 0.44%. However, Russell's 2,000 up 0.6%, looking pretty good here. Financials at break even, dollar break even, crude oil up nearly 3%, gold higher by nearly 2%, silver higher by 2.4%. Fear dropping by 1.8%. We're at 18 right there. Fear Bitcoin, Bitcoin, Bitcoin is at 8,911 break even. GBTC up 1%. Here we are looking at the markets as a whole. Start off here with the spiders. The spiders. <clears throat> We're consolidating, going sideways. Oh, before I do that, guys, you'll love this. We had a meet and greet in Naples, Florida. It's our first one, coffee with D7. We have coffees with Mark the Meerkat and D7 in the Midwest. And here's, I'll show you the picture. This is Paul, he's a retired detective sergeant of the state police in Pennsylvania. This is... Jim, Jim is a pilot for American, and he, he's been doing it 27 years. And that's Keisha, the assistant back here. That's me, D7. We met up. Now, I'll give you a little story here. We were meeting up at this coffee place, but it was on St. Patty's Day. And right where the coffee place was is right where the parade was coming through. So they locked down all the streets. Um we had our car, so I had a car, Keisha had a car, and we almost got locked inside the perimeter of this, and we could not, there would be no place to, anyway, it was a mess. We finally found a Starbucks down the road, and it was a great meeting. Really appreciate meeting those guys. We're doing more of these. If you go to, and if you want to uh, meet up with us just to have a chance to meet we have a brand new website. If you go to grocktrade.com, I spent a lot of time the last few days simplifying this website. Look how clean this looks. Let me know what you think about this. But if you scroll down to the bottom, 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 go all the way down to the bottom, it says, get more information on local coffee with Mark, the Meerkat, and D7. Right here is the areas, Indianapolis, Chicago, Columbus, Cincinnati, Louisville. If any of these areas are within driving distance for you, like, for example, Paul uh, drove three hours to come meet. He's been watching us about eight years. Paul, you are awesome. Been watching us a long time. Please, I want to meet you. Mark wants to meet you. Come and be a part. If you have any, if you, if you can be here, click one, put this. We'll let you know dates and locations, um, fun times. Okay, let's get back to stock trading, technical analysis. This is what I see here. We had this nice run up on the S&P 500. We had this big drop and now we're, we're just chopping sideways. Do you see the moving averages? See how they're splitting? This is going into a big time pinching pattern. Look for a massive move, a big, big move. It's coming guys, it's going to happen. But I have a sell on that at this moment. We're heading down, down, down. I'm gonna stay with my sell. I'm gonna get rid of this line for the time being. But this is, con this is a big, big consolidation. If I had a gun to my head and had to say, Will this does it have a better chance of going higher on the triangle or lower? I'd say higher because we're having a hard time getting back to these support levels. See this? This line, we vacated it. We cannot hit this or we haven't. We didn't hit it here. We're not hitting it here at least so far. But look how close we're hitting this one up here. We did hit it there. So I see that we have probably have a better chance of going up than down. If you look here at the diamonds, have a sell on that. But look at this beautiful symmetrical triangle. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Uh, NASDAQ. Here, we got to sell on it down, but we're in an uptrend. Higher swing highs, higher swing lows. It's looking more bullish to me than what we're seeing. But I want to share something with you. I'm going to get geeky on you for just a second. Let me get, uh, let me simplify it here. Um, let me get rid of this line. But look at this run up. We go up, 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 up. Then we gap up. Do you see the gap? So there's that's called an open window. That open window here means, like, see this line coming across? Act like it's a bullet. It's a laser, it's just a laser coming across. We go right there, it kinda, it's, there's an open window here, okay? It comes up and does this, 
and then we gap down and there's another open window. This is called an island reversal. This is a bearish island reversal pattern and this is highly concerning to me. And this is on the NASDAQ, by the way. The net Qs came up, gapped up, open window, we build an island, we gap down another open island. Do you see how if we were to shoot a line, I'll just draw a line here. Do you see how if I put a line there, not, it doesn't get touched on either side of those? There's your island. It's almost like an, a, it's an exotic abandoned baby reversal pattern. I'm getting geeky on you here. But this could be highly bearish, highly, highly, highly bearish and um, so I'm I'm holding my breath on this one. I have to see what's going to go. I am flat the market at this moment. I've been flat for a while with this turbulence. I'm not con I'm not convinced that we're going one direction or the other at this moment. We got it. These symmetric triangles need to break out or break down. Something needs to happen. But watch the Nasdaq. This is highly problematic. This is one of these rare formations that no one knows about. I've been doing this 20 years, a long time, but I'm sharing it with you. So this is one I'm watching. Small cap, so what's interesting, I put a buy on it today because it's a bull pullback. We hammered out a couple days ago. We popped today. People sold into the strength, but you know, right now we're above most of the moving averages. It's looking pretty bullish to me. It's looking pretty bullish here. It's looking pretty bullish looking pretty bullish um if you go to financials financials i gotta sell on it this line oh, let me to tweak it to the latest of movements so um, i feel pretty good about that i'm gonna get rid of this one now there's some old old lines and yeah it's a we're, big triangle we're just chopping guys we're just chopping sideways. U.S. dollar, got to sell on it. Did pop up. I'm gonna stay with my sell. This is dropped. Um, big run on oil. Look at this. Down, down, down. Put a buy on it. Chopped around. Stayed with my buy, and then boom. There's your symmetrical triangle breakout. So that's what we're looking for. See this coiling, 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 moving averages in the center, and then finally broke out on this day right there. Boom. There would have been the buy day right there. Buy day would have been on the 16th. I did not get in it, but boom, there it is. That's what I'm looking for across the markets. Gold, what a choppy mess this has been. And every time I call it a buy, I'm putting a sell and buy. But this buy actually worked out. It's looking good on gold. Silver, I got a buy on it as of today, but we're at resistance. We smacked our head at resistance and stopped. But gold and silver has been highly, highly turbulent. VIX, got a buy on it from oh, what, the 13th, and we continue higher. I'll stay with my VIX. Um, Bitcoin, we got a buy on on this hammer off of support. Big symmetrical triangle, guys. Buy it off of support going higher. Let's see what happens. This is a bear pullback. It could drop with a doji. It could drop right here. If so, it could be a tr symmetrical triangle break down <clears throat> on that GBTC. Has a have a buy on that, and but it's a bear pullback. It could drop, but I have a buy at least at this moment there. And I'll show you a picture. This is a picture right here of our class that we had this weekend. Mark the Meerkat teaching it. It's done online. It's done online. You can um, and there BJ didn't have his camera turned on there. This is Jay and George and Pete. And Aylin, oh, BJ and Aylin were together. He's in this picture. So he's got it turned off there, but he jumped in her. They were taking it together. <laughs> that's cool. Okay, so that that's kind of neat to see. That was our class this weekend. If you are interested in mentoring and want more information on it, this number right there, you send a text to it. That text should have your name. It should also have your email address. Make sure you get your email address correct there. But a name and email address, and you could even put on there interested in hearing more about mentoring or whatever. Feel free to say hi if you'd like. Or tell us where you're at in your, you know, if you've been trading 20 years, you've been trading 10 years, been trading a year. Tell us if you're a beginner and you're just interested in trading. You want to make some money out there. Send a text to that right there. Okay, guys, that's it. I had a great trip in Naples, Naples, Naples. I was in Naples. I was in Tampa. Some of you guys know I'm an entrepreneur. Some, most of you guys are too. I'm not going to say most, but many of you guys are entrepreneurs. 
I'm an entrepreneur at heart, man. I love business. I love trading. I love being able to analyze something like the charts and and put a calculated risk on the table for big upside gain. Business is the same way. I just enjoy it. I enjoy uh, the hunt. I enjoy the uh, problems to be solved. I, but really what does it for me is meeting the needs. Um, a good business always meets a need for somebody. So people get great joy out of whatever it is you're doing. Helps them with uh, just efficiency in, in things that they're doing. Helps uh, it makes their life easier. You know, there's just a, a number of different benefits that come from business. But trading is one of these things that there's just no business like it. It, it is. Trading is the best business model out there. Now, think about this best business model one the employees can't can't quit or you you don't have to fire them right my dollars are employees they have to be making me money not losing me money and i can be i could be as aggressive as i want to be to make money in the markets or i could be as conservative as i want to be in the markets for example i was traveling the last couple of weeks and I thought it'd be best to sit on my hands, just pull the money out of the markets while the markets chop sideways. I don't want to have to watch it too closely. That's the joy of trading. If the markets start to crash and burn, I love that because I can make money 66% faster to the downside than going up. Have you ever heard the term that the stocks take the stairs up, but jump out of the window on the way down? <laughs> it's true. So money can be made really quickly to the bear side. Even in retirement accounts, in your IRA, there's something called bear ETFs or inverse um, ETFs that allow you to buy. You, you buy these ETFs, these exchange-traded funds, they're like mutual funds, in your IRAs, in your retirement account. But when the market goes down, those instruments, those, those securities that you bought, those ETFs, go up. They're inverse. They do the opposite of the market. So it's an amazing way to make money when the market drops. So it is good to be back, my friends. Good to be back. So if you, hey man, if you want to join us for our mentorship coming up. Oh, and for all you guys, we have a live one coming up in June. So normally we do them online. So you can, anywhere in the world, you can take it. You can be part of this. And, um, but we, a couple times a year, we, we, we do it in um, Las Vegas, but we're looking to do them in some other locations here in the States. But right now, June is Las Vegas. That one always fills. We only take 20 people, okay? 20 is it. And, um, and anyway, if you're interested in doing a live mentorship in Vegas and you'd like to be like, hey, I want to be there in person for the three days instead of online with video cameras for three days, that's fine. Um, but again, that number that I did showed you earlier, text us and say, Vegas, I'm interested in that. Okay, we will catch up with you guys later. 